Today we celebrate the feast of Saint Simon the Zealot and Saint Jude Thaddeus. Saint Simon the Zealot. Simon was surnamed the Zealot for his rigid adherence to the Jewish law and to the Canaanite law. He was one of the original followers of Christ. Western tradition is that he preached in Egypt and then went to Persia with Saint Jude. They both suffered martyrdom. Eastern tradition says Simon died peacefully at Edessa. His feast day is October 28th. Saint Jude Thaddeus. Saint Jude, known as Thaddeus, was a brother of Saint James the Less and a relative of our Savior. He was one of the twelve apostles of Jesus. Biblical scholars agree Saint Jude was a son of Clophis and his mother Mary was the Virgin Mary's cousin. Ancient writers tell us that he preached the gospel in Judea, Samaria, Edomia, Syria, Mesopotamia and Libya. Jude was the one who asked Jesus at the last supper why he would not manifest himself to the whole world after his resurrection. Pilgrims came to St. Jude's grave to pray and many reported a powerful intercession leading to the title, The Saint for the Hopeless and the Despaired. There are two mentions of St. Jude in the New Testament, Luke chapter 6 verse 16 and Acts chapter 1 verse 13. In John chapter 14 verse 22, a disciple called Judas, not Iscariot, is assumed to be the Apostle Jude. A Roman Catholic Prayer to Saint Jude O Most Holy Apostle, Saint Jude, faithful servant and friend of Jesus, the Church honored and invoked thee universally as the patron of hopeless cases and of things almost despaired of. Pray for me, who am so miserable. Make use, I implore thee, of that particular privilege accorded to thee, to bring visible and speedy help, where help is almost despaired of. Come to mine assistance in this great need, that I may receive the consolation and succor of heaven in all my necessities, tribulations and sufferings, particularly here mention your request, and that I may praise God with thee and all the elect throughout eternity. I promise thee, O blessed Jude, to be ever mindfully of this great favour, to always honour thee as my special and powerful patron, and to gratefully encourage devotion to thee. Amen.